We are at OIP Pizza in Lynchburg, Virginia off of Timberlake and Waterlick Road. I personally have never been here before, so this is the first pizza review we're doing at a place I've never been. Um, but we're gonna check out the pizza, see how it is, give you a review, give you some feedback, and let you know whether this is a place to check out or to try some of the other places on our pizza review list. So let's get started. Oh, I've been here before. I love it. It's my favorite pizza place in Lynchburg prior to this review that we're doing. Never been. I've had a calzone here before once. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, a buffet. That's fun. I do like that they have a Steelers logo in their kitchen, so already bonus points for atmosphere. <laughs> buffet. I like buffet. 10 95 I mean, you can't beat it. And there's chicken out there, I think, too. Let's see, they got some pepperoni up here. Some bacon pizza. Mm -hmm. And is that mushrooms? Mushrooms, yeah. Or potatoes? It's mushrooms. Okay. <laughs> or right, what are you going to order? Oh, uh, buffalo chicken pizza, probably. Okay. Let's see, how much is that? Buffalo chicken pizza. It's expensive, it's like 18 bucks. 18? So, 10.95 for all you can eat. And some tendies. Spaghetti? Yeah, the buffet is the move. I don't know what they're doing. <laughs> Got a bacon pizza, a mushroom pizza with a ton of mushrooms on it. I thought they were potatoes. And then a cheese pizza under here. And some spaghetti. They do like look like potatoes. Chicken tenders. Some of this penne pasta with the creamy Alfredo type sauce. And breadstick. The bacon pizza reminds me of the type of pizza that you get at the cafeteria growing up in elementary school. So Dang. that's the feeling so far on the bacon pizza. Hopefully others are better. This one and this one are both not very good. The cheese, plain cheese is pretty good the cheese one is better than these and this one has it's too many mushrooms like look at that it's like mostly mushrooms calzone what you want you want to watch the cheese pool oh yeah yeah <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. wow <laughs> that was an impressive cheese pool i could have kept going <laughs> cheese pool yeah dude that, that is insane. that is some insane cheese if i ate that i'd be dead would you be well, I'm lactose intolerant. Me too. <laughs> Me too, man. But like, look at that cheese. <laughs> <laughs> I might have to like eat this with a knife and fork. I think you need a knife and fork for that. That's a crazy situation you got going on. Yeah. So, it's really good. The buffalo sauce is good. Cheese is good. The chicken, it's I think it's the same chicken from the buffet. Oh, the it chicken tastes like tenders. it. Yeah. But it's still good. So, I mean, I really like it. Um, super, super cheesy. Calzone's great. Um, no complaints. Look at all that meat. Is it really meaty? Cheese pizza? I had cheese like bacon, I had the chicken tenders, I had the banana pudding, I had a breadstick. <laughs> I had the buffet. Um, honestly, for a 10.95 buffet, it was really good. I like the pizza here. Apparently, that means I like cafeteria-style pizza. Whatever, I don't care. I like the pizza. Um, I like the ratio of sauce to cheese to crust. It was all there. Um, and the crust is a little crispy, which I like that little bit of bite and texture at the end. Chicken tenders were meh, but they were buffet chicken tenders. Breadsticks were really good. I liked those. Um, and banana pudding was vanilla wafers and banana pudding, so it's going to taste can't like that. Do that wrong. Yeah, like, yeah. <laughs> it tastes the same wherever you go. Great deal. I like the variety. I like being able to choose. I like this place. Yeah. The pepperoni pizza is my favorite pizza of the four that I tried, so I, I would say that I'd recommend this place. Um, to me, it's nothing special, but it's not bad, and I think it's better than the first two places that we've tried. Pepperoni pizza would be my choice. And now it's scoring time. So it came out to a 7.32 or a 7.35, which is also a highest rating so far. We hit that above average. Service was top tier. It was great. We had a really nice waitress. It was fast. The food came out fast. Um, so that was really good. We liked the service. Um, um, price point was pretty good. The buffet was a great deal. Buffet was a great deal for sure. Bennett referred to it as high level cafeteria food, which is supposedly not a knock. I think that's a knock, but supposedly it's it's I'll not go that bad. Say comfort food. Yeah, it was more of like not comfort food. It feels familiar. Cafeteria it's... food is more of like a slight. 
Yeah, it's like familiar. Okay. Um, Julie, myself, and Bennett, uh, we loved all the Steelers memorabilia that was up there. That was great. Um, and we thought that it had strong Sunday post-church vibes. Um, so if you want to get stampeded after church on a Sunday, go to Virgin Italian Pizza. You want to know how good the sauce is? It's good sauce. Yeah. Mmm. Sauce. Gross.